Greetings, my most unworthy subjects. I, if you're not already aware, which you should be, am Marissa Boulevard, the most beautiful and intelligent girl in the world. And today, on the couch, I am going to be talking about evil and why I love it. Marissa Boulevard Perfect in every way. Someone help me. <laughs> what did you think of my evil laugh? I'm still working out the kinks a bit. But I have taken over the Almost Everything channel. Gorman, as we speak, is in solitary confinement. Marissa? Marissa? Damn you, Marissa Boulevard! The Seth Lewis robot has a paperclip put in its back and is malfunctioning as we speak. Zero one zero one 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 zero zero one 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 zero one. I still don't know what has happened to Harold, Caroline, Frank, and Jerry. Oh, but if you do see them, please let me know so they can be. How do I put this? Um, properly punished. <laughs> ah. Anyways, ever since I was a little girl, I have had dreams of taking over the world, of watching it burn in fire, and people putting up statues of me in my honor. But alas, little girls do not always get their dreams come true. Sometimes mean little children from Southern High thwart their plans. But today I want to discuss my defense of evil, because there has been a defense of love video. And do you know what happens when you turn love backwards? Do you know what it spells? That's right, evil. I want you all to think about that for a second. Uh, Marissa, wouldn't that spell evolve? Shut up, Nora, no one asked your opinion. <sighs> but... Anyways, people try to say there is no necessity for evil. But as there has to be both light and darkness, both black and white, there must be both good and evil. You, you can't have one without the other. And besides, if we try to stamp out the murderers and the torturers and the tramps of the world, don't we end up becoming like them when we do the same crimes as they do to their victims? Aren't we their equals? No. It is simply a fact of life. There must be evil. And may it be said that many a great person has been evil. These individuals have committed atrocity after atrocity, making the world a worse place to live in. And let's face it, Dr. Evil is hot. But you can't help but respect these men's visions. And yet, people refuse to acknowledge the good these individuals do for society. How their evil innators reduce overpopulation. How tormentors make their victims stronger and even better people. And who wants a world of a bunch of goody-two-shoes? Wouldn't that be boring? Why always play it safe? Doesn't law-breaking make life interesting? And I would argue that freedom is always a bit evil. To prove my point, I would like to show you all a video of the first time that I ever met Seth Lewis. Seth and Marissa in preschool. Children of Yoclades Elementary, I am Marissa Boulevard, the queen of evil, and you shall all bow before me. But I don't know how to bow. I'm four years old. You don't know how to bow to your goddess? You should have been prepared for this! W what is your name, child? Seth Lewis. Seth Lewis, you must give up your will to evil. Go and break your toys, or throw a tantrum, in the name of Marissa Boulevard. But I don't want to be evil. I want to be friends with everybody. Let's all hug each other and love each other, and be happy to be alive. 
No! No, don't you all realize what he's doing? He's going to seduce you! He's going to bend you to his will with his infernal hugs! Oh, curse you, Seth Lewis! Evil will prevail and I shall have my vengeance! Ah! You see, you see everyone, that's what happens. Okay, let's go back to the couch. And so, I ask you today to embrace your evil side and stop pushing it away. Because the more you push it away, the more you deny it, the stronger it becomes. And really, you're not being your true self. So go out there and commit crimes, break windows, steal things. And do it all in the name of Marissa Boulevard. Now, if you'll excuse me, I am going to continue practicing my evil laugh. <laughs> Feel that might have been too forced. <clears throat> yeah, too much like a witch. That's a work in progress. Ah, I got it. Live spelled backwards is evil. You can't live without evil. Take that, Nora.